Welcome back to Good Day Columbia. And we are here this morning with Karen Smith. Now, she is the Regional Vice President for TD Bank. And we're going to be talking about something special. But before we get into that, Ms. Karen, I want to wish you, well, I guess, happy anniversary. That's correct. We are celebrating our one-year anniversary here in South Carolina as TD Bank. And we are excited that the year is behind us and we have so much in front of us. Well, we enjoy TD Bank here in the Palmetto State. Have you, have you had a good year so far? Has it been a good experience for you? We have. It's been a great experience. TD is so committed to the employees, their customers, the communities in which we serve. It's just been a great experience for us. Well, Karen, I'm glad you said that because we're talking about actually serving our communities and you guys have found the best way to do that and uh, I want to go ahead and let you tell our viewers what you've decided to do to celebrate your anniversary. Well what we're doing we have an, an initiative that we are taking place today um, June 19th and it's entitled um, Acts of Kindness and this is our way to give back to the communities in which we serve thanking them for for banking with us um, all across the state. What we're doing actually is we are doing random acts of kindness. We have about 150 TD employees that are volunteering throughout the state today okay. performing random acts of kindness, whether it's um, carrying groceries um, for people at grocery stores to their cars, um, providing water um, to people out on the street, um, they're at parks, um, providing frisbees, hand sanitizer, um, they're actually doing car washes paying for donuts and coffee at various places. And more importantly, or, or equally as important, is a lot of volunteers are working with nonprofit organizations throughout the state. Now, that is fantastic, and that's something that's close to our hearts here as well. We have a Pay It Forward initiative, and we're always uh, hoping that our viewers and residents of the Midlands will go out there and just be kind to each other. Just take a, an extra moment to do something nice. It doesn't have to cost you any money. It really doesn't have to cost you any energy either it's it's pretty easy to do so are you guys going to be at specific locations or are you just throwing 150 people out in the community and letting them go for it no actually the 150 is across the state however here in columbia the um, nonprofit organizations that we will be working with um, we've got volunteers going um, working with the saluda shoals beautification project they will be cleaning up the park on bush river road We've got a number of volunteers at the Irmo Chapin Recreation Center. Mm -hmm. They're going to be helping prepare meals for the meal service that that group provides. We've got um, a group um, of TD employees working with Habitat for Humanity. They will be stocking the shelves at the West Columbia location. They'll be taking in donations, organizing those. Um, so many great ways to pay it forward and do random acts of kindness. And I understand you have a story in your recent past at a grocery store. And I want our readers, or sorry, our viewers to know just how easy it is. And it's usually spontaneous. I know that your employees are going out planning on these acts of kindness, but sometimes it just happens in the course of life. Tell us that brief story again. Um, I was at the grocery store and there was a, a nice lady in front of me and she had three items that she couldn't pay for. And so I told her, don't worry, I'll take care of it. There were three minor items. And when she went to pay, it was taking all of her money that she had to pay for the items that she had purchased. So I told her, don't worry, I would just take care of her, of her bill. It wasn't enormous, but she, you know, was so grateful. And um, it was just a small act of kindness. And you're right, it was just spontaneous. It's something you don't plan for. Now let me ask you this, because this is what I want people to really get. Um, how did it feel? knowing that you affected her life that way. I understand she gave you a hug, you even had comments from the cashier saying, you know, she'd never really seen anybody do that before. How did that affect the rest of your day? Well, actually, the, the cashier said, um, I've never seen anybody do that before. And I was like, that was really sad because we do need to do things like this. And, and that's why I'm so proud of TD Bank for committing to the communities because we really do truly believe in helping the communities, serving um, the communities we're involved in. That's where our employees live, our customers live. Mm -hmm. And actually we um, make it a point to, to, I wouldn't say poll our customers and employees, but we want to know from our customers and our employees what their concerns are, what issues they care about, and we try to match our donations to those issues um, and contribute that way as well in addition to 
things like we're doing today. Well, I love what you're doing today, and I hope that other uh, leaders in our community and businesses kind of follow suit, because basically you're practicing corporate responsibility. You know, we've been encouraging our viewers on an individual basis to go out there and maybe pay the toll for somebody behind you or a meter or whatever, or even just give somebody a smile when you can tell they need one. I mean, it's just as simple as that. But corporations actually have the opportunity to do this en masse. And when you have, you know, a hundred plus people out there committing good deeds, that's going to have a fantastic ripple effect around the community. So you guys are putting your money where your mouth is, and I appreciate that. Well, we thank our communities. We really do. And we are so happy to be here. And um, it's going to be a great day throughout the state. Well, we're going to hear all about it because some of your employees are going to actually share their stories right. on our Pay It Forward tab, which is on our Facebook page. And I invite all of you to stop by and, you know, tell a story like uh, Miss Karen did here about an experience that you had, whether someone paid it forward to you or you did something kind for someone else. And I really want everyone to know just how, how good it feels. It, it is a part of, it's an intrinsic part of our inner happiness to serve others in small ways and large. So we appreciate that. Thank you so much for representing TD Banks. Thanks for coming to South Carolina and thanks for coming to our studio. Thanks for having us. All right. We will be back with more today.